Okay, guys, so it's Janet's opening night of her world tour in Canada. There she is. And somebody's periscoping it. Look. There, there she, she is. is. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. It's Monday morning, August 31st, last day of August. Happy Monday. So, I'm headed off to work. Brad's up here peeling potatoes for dinner tonight for the roast. Marco's going to school. Bye, Ash. Bye, I love you. Oh, I guess I gotta give you a kiss. Goodbye. I love you. I love you later. I will. Bye, I love you. Have a good day. So, got to hurry here. It's Monday, so traffic's gonna be bad, so I gotta try to get out of here. Sorry. So, made it out of the garage. Okay, so I'm on the road, and I should have left earlier. I say that every morning. I so need to start leaving earlier. Hopefully the traffic's not too bad, because I'll be rushing again. I usually rush in to work at the last minute. Just trying to get up to the time clock to clock in on time. What's this crazy car doing up here? Pick a lane, get in it. Oh, he's turning. But it's my Friday and I'm on vacation after today. So I had the rest of this week off. Nothing planned this week really. We already took our vacation in March to California to see my brother. So we're not doing another big vacation and Brad has to work anyway. He'll be off Thursday, or wait, Wednesday and Thursday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday with me, but then he'll have to work Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. The last four days of my vacation, vacation, he'll have to work. I think he said he might try to get off early one day, maybe, or something. And I think we're gonna try to have a birthday party for Marco this weekend, I believe, because his birthday's not this weekend, but next weekend, uh, September 12th, he'll turn 13 years old. He's growing so fast, he's like, just getting so tall all of a sudden and he's gonna be taller than me probably by next year it's crazy how fast they grow okay good morning guys on my way to work got Ralphie to daycare I'm on my way to work and I'm just gonna tell you guys I'm using my phone to vlog and now three times I have screwed up a vlog because you can't just turn the phone around and crap. I'm tired of using my phone. I mean, quit vlogging till Brett buys me a camera. If he wants me to vlog too, he's gonna have to buy me a camera because this using the phone thing is starting to get on my last nerve. So, um, that's, that's it. I'll check in later. I got some cool things going on at work that I'm going to do today, so we'll see in a few. So guys, I was on my way to work this morning, and I don't know how my truck did it, but for some reason, it just made me pull into Starbucks. I didn't even do it on my, on my own. The truck just made me go in there. Pulled in, wouldn't start again until I went in and got a Starbucks, and then it started. Uh, I haven't had a Starbucks in a while. Mm. Love it. All right, I'm off of work and I'm on vacation. What? What? Hold on. Speed bump. Speed bump. So, starting my vacation, and it's a hot start to my vacation. It's back up to the 90s. It's 91 right now. My phone says. And my car is hot because I forgot to put my uh, 
sun visor of my car. Actually, I didn't forget. I was running really late this morning and I didn't have time to put it up. That's how late I was running. I had to literally jump out of my car and go up to the building real fast. And I just barely made it in on time. So, so I had to sit here and let the air cool off for a while because it's hot. So, I am headed to get Ralphie from daycare because Brad works till, I think he works till eight. I think they work, today's the 31st and I think the salon is still open till eight tonight and then tomorrow on the first they start closing at seven. But I think tonight they're still open till eight. I think. But uh, anyway, so I'm gonna go get Ralphie from daycare but first I'm gonna stop at Walmart because my niece posted on Facebook that she found the M the the uh, M and M pecan pie M and M's and the Keebler pumpkin spice fudge strips. I think is what they are. And I was looking for those, but I haven't been able to find them. So I figured I would get those, and then I will do a little taste test video with Brad and the boys with the uh, pumpkin spice latte M and M's I have and the caramel apple Oreos. I don't know if I'm gonna do it all together in one video or separate them out. I'm not sure yet. We'll try to figure it out. I might do the M&Ms in like a separate video. If a separate video for just the M&Ms and the cookies in another video, maybe. We'll see. But anyway, I'm gonna stop by there first and see if they have them. Hopefully they do. She said she got them and she just got them yesterday, so. Head into Walmart real quick to see if they got them. All right guys, I'm in Walmart and I thought I would show you they have the new Yankee Candle. American home, but they have them in the uh, they have the large jars now. They are $14.93 for the large jars. I don't see the large tumblers, but they also have these small tumblers. They're $4.93 for these small ones. This is a four ounce, and of course, the medium ones. Oh, they do have the large tumblers. They're $14.93 for the large tumblers, too. It's just got the plastic lid on the top, too. But they're all paraffin wax. And then they have these, the fragrance beads they got in. Those are $3.43. And then they have the votives down here. And the votives are $1.43. So yeah, just thought I would show you that real quick. I guess they got them all out now here at my store anyway. I still don't think they have all the scents though because there was 20 cents online and I don't think they have them all here. But they got all the different sizes though. Okay, so I left Walmart. Well, actually I'm in my car. I just got out of Walmart and I found the, oh, let me show you here. The pecan pie M&M's. So, now we have the pecan pie and the pumpkin spice lattes to do a taste test and review, but I couldn't find the Keebler uh, pumpkin spice fudge stripes. They must have been out because I didn't see, I didn't even see a spot for them, but my niece says she found them here, so I don't know if they sold them all and then they just filled them with the, I found the original, but I couldn't find the pumpkin spice ones. So I'll have to check back later for those. At least I got the M&Ms and then I got some wax melts. Of course, I can't come to Walmart without getting some wax melts. I have to look there every time. I don't get a whole bunch at one time. I just kind of, every time I go, I get, you know, two or three or four, maybe five. But uh, I got warm apple pie from Sensationals. This one here is so good. This is the new one that came out this year. It's not new this year. It's been out before. It came out last year. This is the new packaging, should I say. I ended up getting two of those because I love this scent. <clears throat> I had a burning, um, I actually had, I used it last year and then I just finished it up this year, like a week ago or so. And it was so strong. It seemed even stronger this year than when it was last year when I used it. It was like so strong, it filled up. I had two cubes in my centerpiece in the living room and two cubes in the uh, my Yankee wax warmer, the regular electric warmer um, in the living room, and it was incredible. It was just such a good scent. 
warm apple pie, cinnamon bakery, so good. And it was lasted a long time too. This thing lasted probably about two to three days and I had it on 24 seven. I didn't turn it off at all and it lasted a long time. A little strong for Brad. Brad said it was giving him a headache, but <laughs> I liked it. So anyway, I had to pick up some more of those and then they had farm apple pumpkin from Better Homes and Gardens. And I love this one too. It smells a lot like apple pumpkin from Bath or uh, Yankee Candle and pumpkin apple from Bath and Body Works. The same scent. And I ended up getting, oh shoot, I dropped one. Well, I got two of them. I dropped the other one on the floor here. But I got two because they had a marked down for a dollar and I don't know why. It was the only one that said a dollar. And I'm like, is that right? But it rang up a dollar, so I don't know why. Um, so I got two of them. They only had two left, so good deal there. A dollar for that. It was awesome. So, all right, I will have to uh, find those cookies somewhere I get somewhere else, I guess. I think they just came out, so they should be coming everywhere pretty shortly. So, okay, now I gotta leave and go get Ralphie. Oh, and I forgot to talk about those Yankee candles that I just showed you. The uh, they were 14. Was it 1483 for the large jars and the tumblers, which is not really that great of a price because you all know that if you get a coupon for buy two get two or buy one get one free. You can get them for $13.99 at the retail stores, which is better than $14.83 here. And then, of course, the friends and family, you can get them for like $11.20. But I think they should at least have them marked down to $12 at least. Or, you know, I think they should mark the medium ones down to like $8 or so maybe. And then the large ones like $10 or $11. You know, but $14.83 is kind of high. But I don't know. At least, I mean, like I said in my review of the one I did... I guess it's, you know, of course at Yankee you have to have a buy one, get one code or a coupon or something in order to get that price. But here there always be that price, which is a little bit more, you know, it's what, 84 more cents than $13.99. But, you know, you don't ever have to have a coupon for that. So there'll always be that price, but I don't know. I do want to try another one because the one I did have try, it did have a good throw. So I'm kind of curious to see if another one will be, you know, have a good throw too. And so maybe, I don't know if they, are going to be hit and miss like the ones at the retail store as far as throw goes so i mean if i am guaranteed to throw then i would buy more but i don't know we'll see i might try one again eventually but okay now i'm off to get ralphie okay i got ralphie hi guys Did you have a get rich, rich. he picked me up early i did Have a good day. Did you have a good day? Yes. Yes? That's good. So now we're heading home. And Brad will be home in a couple hours probably. Usually we're still eight, but he never gets home. He always seems to get home really late for some reason. But like I said, I don't know if he's getting home close to seven or eight tonight. So this will be a surprise when he gets home, I guess. A moon. This is kind of hard, but you were doing it before, I think. Crescent, blue crescent. Blue crescent. How, how was he being happy? I don't know. I don't know. It's a diamond. It says blue rhombus. A blue rhombus star. Yes, I forgot to show. Octagon. 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 Yeah. Oh, hi. Okay. You know what that is. Easy. A D. What shape is that? All four sides equal. One, one, two, three, four. Four sides? Mm -hmm. All the same size. I don't know. Square. Square. A. That was the shape. 
Ralph, you know this. He knows this. He's just playing silly. You know what that is? Hexagon? No. <laughs> it's a triangle. Triangle. Just had this one. <laughs> Come on. Gray. Four sides. You just had it. I just one, the answer. two, three, four. Four sides of what? I don't know. Square. <laughs> Hard. Good job. <laughs> Diamond. No. I don't know. Semicircle. Semicircle. Let's try it again. Four sides. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I just said it. What is it? Rectangle. No. Square. Square. Say it again. Square. Square. One more time. Square. Square. Good job. Okay. Circle. Good job. Uh, upside circle. No. It's half a circle. What you call that what? A half a circle. It's called a semicircle. Semicircle? Yes. Triangle. Good job. What's that? Mmm. White? The shape. Shape. I don't know. Orange rectangle. Orange rectangle. rectangle. Say it with me. Rectangle. 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 Okay. Orange pink heart. Good job. Stop. Dancing in the Dancing in the star yellow. Yellow. Yellow star and it's dancing with the stars. Dancing in the stars. I miss you, Daddy. I you miss, miss me. I miss you. Brad's home. I miss you. I miss you. Okay guys, so it's Janet's opening night of her world tour in Canada. There she is. And somebody's periscoping it. Look. There, there she, she is. is. <laughs> Oh God, she's opened up with a new song. Oh, it's Missy Elliott. Person's trying not to film because he's getting trouble from the security. Oh, okay. The security came by and told him to put down the camera because he wasn't allowed to film, but he could take pictures, so he's sneakily doing it. So, all right, I just had to show you that. I'm gonna finish watching now. Okay, guys, that's the end of the vlog for today. It's the end of the night. Brad's going to sleep, but I'm uh. I'm on the phone. I'm on Instagram, not Instagram, Periscope. Check it out, people. At the Janet concert, they just filmed a little bit. Two people did, so I'm all looking on Facebook for updates and all kinds of stuff, so I'm kind of going crazy right now. I'm on a Janet high. I have to get up at like six, so I can go get everybody to take my mom to her appointment tomorrow. I got, we gotta be there at like 745 because she has to be there 15 minutes before her appointment so I gotta get up early 
Yeah, and then Mom and Aunt Shirley come down tomorrow. Them old broads. I know, we just can't get rid of them. Can't get rid of them. Just kidding. We love them. We love having them around. And then uh, they're going to spend the night tomorrow night, too. So. Yep, battery's flashing. We better go. Yeah. All right. I got to go catch up on Janet. Let's see what song she's doing next. Hopefully somebody will film it without getting in trouble. Good night, y'all. Good night.